what's going on guys first check in with regards to the paste wax versus ultimate liquid wax so let's do a quick test with this hole okay it should be obvious right now that the paste wax the water is running off way quicker look the liquid wax has still got water just waiting to run off let's do another check I mean, there's really no contest there. The paste wax is performing way better. We'll check in again in one week and see how they're doing. All right, guys, we're now two weeks on from initial application. Let's see how these two waxes are performing. Now, you may remember whenever I initially did the first video, I commented that the liquid wax wasn't, uh, it wasn't curing on the paint and I, I didn't know if I'd done it right. I've since looked up and it is in fact the case that the liquid wax never fully dries according to the Maguire's official forums. So I was a bit worried that maybe the, any poor performance from the liquid wax could be down to me not applying it right, but rest assured I applied it 100% correctly. So got our hose, let's see how they do. Let's get up close. They both seem to be doing pretty well on a straight up side by side. Actually, I'd say the liquid wax on the side is doing, it's pretty close to the paste wax. Now let's kind of focus on each area one by one. So we'll do. I mean, you can see here that it's still a little bit slow to throw water off. You know, it's still there. Whereas if we do this side, You know, the water does run off a lot quicker. But I have noticed that in when you do a test, you could definitely say that the paste wax performs better. But in day-to-day -day driving and just, you know, after rainstorms, I have been hard pressed to tell the difference. However, I think overall the paste wax is definitely one to go for. It's it's easier to apply. Uh, you get a marginally better look and okay in day-to-day -day scenarios you can't tell much of a difference but in you know kind of laboratory testing you can say that the paste wax does have an advantage and I expect there are some day-to-day -day situations where that would show through okay so, so which of these two products would I recommend they're both great products for 30 pounds in fact right now they're on sale they're down to like 25 uh, they're both fine products However, I would say that the paste wax is clearly the better product. It's easier to apply, it comes off easier, um, it gives you a slightly better look, a slightly better shine, and I expect it will last longer. And we've shown here that the water behavior, uh, two weeks on, one week on and two weeks on, is slightly ahead of the liquid wax. So I would go with the paste wax and um, if you need something that's more liquidy, you think it'll be easier to apply, I would honestly save your money and go for something like uh, Auto Glim's Extra Gloss Protection because that's cheaper and it's easy to apply and honestly, I would just skip the liquid wax. If you've got a bottle in the cupboard, keep using it. It's a great product. But if you're going out to the shop, I would definitely skip it and go with the paste wax or save some money and get something like Auto Glim's Extra Gloss Protection. Tune in next time, guys and uh, we'll be doing some more wax tests. I just bought Auto Glim's Ultra HD wax, which we're gonna be testing. So I know some of you will wanna see that. So tune in and we'll see how that compares.